Hello there, watchy people. How is it going? Welcome back to my garage with uh, the El Cremino project car. Um, I I think I need to turn my graphics up a bit. I don't know what settings they're on right now. I should sorry. I should have done this before I started. In fact, I don't think I can even do it during a game. Bear with me. I'm going to see if I can turn my graphics up anymore uh, and see if we can get a better chrome effect off of that. Okay, well, as it turns out, the options were in-game, but uh, putting it on Ultra doesn't seem to have improved it much, so uh, <laughs> never mind. That is a shame. Um, but yes, sorry, I, I interrupted my own uh, intro there. Um, yes, I thought that because we had a new car this week, uh, the Jesse here, um, it was worth having more than one video. I thought it would be worth coming back to this this week. Uh, let's just move that. I'm trying to uh, get it onto the lift at the moment. I do. Oh, blimey! I. Oh, that was not what I wanted at all. I did have the handbrake fitted, um, but apparently that uh, doesn't mean anything to Jesse here. Um, but yes, we are going to continue with our um, rebuilding uh, or homage to, as it were. The uh, the El Cremino from uh, from Demolition Ranch, Carica. That's his surname. I was trying to think of it in the last video. Matt Carica. Yes, Matt Carica has built uh, an El Camino into the El Cromino, uh, and it's it's just awesome. So it deserves our uh, homage, I think. Uh, maybe it doesn't because it's pretty rough, but uh, <laughs> we're going to do it anyway because I think it's pretty cool and it would be pretty cool to have this. I, I don't know if anyone else has done this before. Like I said in my last video, it's quite possible someone's already done this because this car's been out for uh, a few days now. So it wouldn't surprise me in the least if someone's already got there before us. Uh, so we have got the front suspension sorted on this thing. Um, all our tools are now outside, so we will we will uh, go in and uh, go in. What am I talking about? Go out and get that one. This is. I really should have put more thought into what I'm doing here. I never put any thought into anything I do, by the way. Just so you know. Just so you know. And um, by the way, I already did this on Tuesday, um, but I didn't mention it. I haven't mentioned it in any videos. Uh, I have now enabled. The uh, super super things in YouTube. Um, they've got super chat, uh, super thanks, and lots of things starting with super that you can do. You can be a member of my channel, all those kinds of things. So if you're the kind of person that uh, feels so inclined, you can do that. You can join the channel. At the moment, there aren't really any benefits other than the the warm glowy feeling you have in uh, in your heart for helping someone out. Um, and and saying sort of thank you for the stuff I do, but I be please do listen to me, people. I do not require you to do that. I am not asking you. I am simply giving you the opportunity, should you choose to accept it. Uh, I do not. Uh, I, I all I need from you is is your view. That's all that matters. But I would love to have a comment as well. That would be awesome, and a like because uh, those things really do help out as well but um, just just know that if all you either can do or want to do is just watch that is totally fine um, I, I do not um, I do not expect any more of you than that um, but yeah as I say should you be so inclined you are more than welcome to help me out um, all the anything that I, I earn on this is seriously is not a lot of money like I'm not not kidding here I'm not gonna they ain't getting rich off this stuff <laughs> believe me believe me um, but yeah anything you do give will go straight back into the channel I'll use it for buying games or for buying equipment uh, in order to improve the quality of the videos um, I just put that down and I, I think I still need it or was it the screwdriver put it down I can't remember um, Right, oh, this is under here, isn't it? Yeah, so anyway, all those things are there. If you have suggestions, by the way, 
um, for things, uh, for, for like incentives, the rewards, that kind of stuff. If you, there's something that you think of that you would like uh, and, you know, you want to be a member and all that, um, then let me know in the comments. I'm totally open to suggestions uh, and would very much love some actually because I don't have any idea what I could offer you guys. Um, so yeah, as I say, please do let me know. It looks like the frame on this thing is actually pretty decent. Um, oh, I, <laughs> I literally said that and then found this. Okay, maybe it's not pretty decent then. Um, what are those bolts for? Oh, that must be the tailgate, I guess. Yeah, okay. Uh, right, well, this is all good. Let's take out the pumpkin, because that's no good. Uh, one, two, it should be three on this, or is there, it looks like there's four on this one. Oh, there we go. That's the pumpkin out. Uh, one, two, three. Yep, yeah, you're out. Excellent. So we got a big old pile of stuff that needs replacing here. Man, this car was expensive. This car was proper expensive, wasn't it? Um, given how bad condition it's in and what I paid for it, that's pretty incredible. Uh, the Actually, the block is fine. The oil pan is fine. The harmonic balancer is fine. The fan and everything is fine. And the transmission is fine. So I, I sort of jumped jumped into that accusation of this car uh, being dreadful. It's not nearly as dreadful as it looks. However, this beam needs to go. Uh, so we'll take that off. And what are you? Will you come out now? You will come. Ah, okay. It's not... Right, so it's not that bit. Uh... Right, in that case, I think we're going to need to start grinding. Because, uh, where are we? Yeah, that's going to need to come out. Uh, which bit was it? So, where, hang on, where are we? What am I looking at? There. There's the front of the car. Okay. So, we need you to come out. Uh, and for that, we need cutting discs, which I believe we have just run out of. So I'll go grab another pack of cutting discs. I keep saying that I'm going to get the uh, the mod that makes them last longer and I don't, I never do it and I don't, oh, I don't want to take just, oh, fine, fine, I'll take just the one. There's probably a whole other pack there as well, isn't there? I probably did this before. Uh, last time I needed to buy one. Okay, right. You need to come out. You need to come out. Why why can I not? Oh, it's because the arm is in the way. There we go. Uh and you. Does that whole piece come out now? It does. Oh, and we get the torsion bars as well. Okay. That's fine. Sure, we'll go with that being fine. Um, right, torsion bar out, torsion bar out, and then you, what do you call yourself by the way? You are the oh, torsion support, that would make sense. Ah, uh, desk, can't get around my desk. Right, all cars, we're gonna go to the Jesse, to the body, and then, Torsion support. There we go. Uh, I said I was very unconfident with my unconfident nerve. Ner what's the word? I don't know what the word is that I'm looking for. Uh, should there be a, a rod around here somewhere? There's one. I see it. I see you. There you are. Oh. I got a little tick for a second there. OK. 
Come on. You can do it. All right. I'll put you on top of there so that I can see you. Turn you over. I'll take you off. And then... Oof. I want the... I want that. Yeah, the electric. Oh, for goodness sake. There we go. On you go. And now we'll bring this machine. Blimey. What, what a palaver. Right. Oh, can't reach that one, of course. Uh, okay, and we're out of that electrode. There's a whole pack over here, though. Though, we are steadily getting through it. There we go. And... Can I reach that one now? Yes. And that one. There it is. Beautiful. Any more? That seems to be the lot. Okay, uh, and now we can put this bit back on under here uh, with the wrench. Tightening. One, two, three, four. And one, two. Lovely. Um, although, we do kind of need to take that engine out. Do we have, yes, we have space on the rack right now. So let's um, pop this on here. We'll move you over here for now. Uh, the torsion bars can go back in. One and two. There we go, lovely. Uh, and tools out the way. Look at me being all organized. Well, not organized, but at least not letting them get... Uh... Well, I can't even think of words to say today. Um, right, we need to open this and we need to get this engine out. So we will loosen one, two, three, four five come on where are you six and then we should there we go be able to remove the engine and tighten you onto there beautiful okay that is absolutely lovely we're now in a good position a very good position so I am gonna start Working on the body panels, I think. That is my goal for today. We're going to get these body panels sorted. Um, uh, what we'll need to do, actually, is prep the other car. Uh, because it's... Oh, come on. It's got stuff in it. Um, or at least it's got the roof in it. You come down here for now. And the tyre, you can stay there. And then we'll use this to hopefully uh, move uh, the bits we need to move. Oh, why are you not in there anymore? There we go. That was strange. I don't know why it decided not... Oh, blimey, that was very easy. Okay, that's that done. Um, I wonder if these ought to be the right colour. They did, 552159. Uh, I'm I'm taking a gamble on this. Five five two one five nine, right? Five five two one five nine. I'm taking a gamble that the value. Uh, I'll just check that. Five five two one five nine. Yeah, we did get it right. The value of the, and condition of the paint job is based on the paint that might be underneath the chrome because we're chroming it it is no longer going to be um, no longer going to be uh, a, a paint colour any paint colour it's literally just going to be um, chrome now I don't know how the game will handle that with the original colour and everything so I'm banking on it deciding that um, if, if the paint that's underneath it is correct then uh, then it will give us full value for the car. 
That is my suspicion, anyway. And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with it and see what happens. So yes, uh, before we go chroming everything, and this is gonna cost us a fortune, by the way, because it's three hundred dollars for every panel that you chrome. Um. So yeah, it could be interesting. I also probably shouldn't do. Um, probably shouldn't do the hood thinking about it because the real El Cromino I don't think has a hood I think the the top of the motor with its ridiculously overpowered stuff um, is sticking out I should probably take that off actually well I'm going to have to take it off anyway to chrome it so there we go that's that side done uh, we seem to be all good on there. Oh, there's a bit more on the top here. There we go. Uh, you have... Okay, apparently I can't do anything with you. Amazing. Amazing. Right, okay. Uh, I guess we start pulling bits off. So let's grab... <coughs> I'm going to leave the hood thinking about it. So let's take that back out and we'll put the hood to one side. We'll lean it up, ag up against this wall, not inside the wall. Uh, I don't even know. Come on. Be a good hood. There we are. Uh, well, better anyway. Cool, right. That'll do. Um, okay, what's next? Let's take another piece off. Uh, oh, actually, I need my screwdriver because I was going to do that front clip. Is that what it's called? I don't think it is. I think the front clip is on a truck. I don't know whether it's uh, translatable. Right, uh, you and you. Apparently, I never undid you. Oh, was I just too far away? Weird, okay. For some reason it didn't like it, but that's fine. Right, so you're cool. Um, what else? We can take, well, we can't take the doors off immediately. Uh, let's start cutting more stuff off then. Um, we'll take the roof. Let's take the roof. Uh, There we go. The roof is done. Uh, we are going to paint it first, obviously, because of the aforementioned reasons. Uh, and we'll see where we get to with it. I'm, I'm really looking forward to this, seeing this finished. I, I've got a feeling it might end up being pretty underwhelming because the chrome is so dull. Um... In, in game, yeah, because it's not got real reflections or anything, I think it's going to look pretty awful. <laughs> uh, but we'll see anyway. I mean, it, it's kind of part of the character of the car, because if you've seen El Camino, the real one, then it's it's in a sorry state. I mean, it's all, yeah, all over the place. <laughs> um, there's little dents and stuff everywhere. Uh can I please? Oh, okay. Let's take the window out, and then let's take the. It won't let me take the roof liner out. Why? Oh, it's because because the uh, thing is there. Um, come on. Turn over, please. There we go. Right. Screwdriver then. Uh, there is the screwdriver loosening. Yeah. Uh, one, two, and oh. there we are. Popped off and then ah okay so that came out with it let's just put the whole thing in there because it's it's no use I'm gonna put the mirror in as well does that I think it looks pretty rough uh, the window however is fine so we'll keep the window uh, over here somewhere and uh, the roof itself is in good condition so we will pop that 
in in there that's it beautiful beautiful right what's next what else can we take we can take that other wing uh one two three i always have to lean for that third one i guess that makes sense um right grab the hose and finish cleaning that up because i saw a little bit of dirt on there oh there's also a bit of uh, rust that i wasn't able to see before. Excellent. That's you sorted then. Lovely. Okay. Oh, we also need to get that uh, trim piece off as well. And we'll move you over here. The bright work can go over there. That's the right word, isn't it? Bright work. I'm sure that's fine. Oh, man. I'm already 21 minutes into this and I've barely made a dent. I was kind of hoping that we might get to see all of the chrome panels today, but I don't think that's going to happen. Um, also, there's a money issue, so I may have to uh, divert and do some... Uh, I don't know if that one... That one was the right colour before we chromed it or not. I don't know. Uh, that's, that's interesting. Uh, right, okay. Let's grab you and lean over there. One, two, can I see these ones? Sort of. Three, four. There we are. Lovely. Uh, you look to be the right colour, I think. And you don't look to have... Oh, there is a bit of uh, paintwork to do on that end. Cool. Now, uh, what did I do with the pry bar? I put it back. I did put it back because I'm a good boy. Uh, okay, there we go. Trim rear. Excellent. Uh, so now we can pop that in here. This is a lot of money's worth. I feel like I might have to um, flip a couple of vehicles. Let's head over to the junkyard uh, where we will make a purchase or two. Uh, what money have we got? Three and a half thousand, isn't it? Just under three and a half thousand, right. Let's see what we got. There is a ton of rust on there. So that's a good one. Oh yeah, there's loads of rust. Right, we'll have you then. Oh, 588 bucks. Bargain. Uh, there is a lot of rust on that. It's also kind of out of shape though. How much is this one? 15. Okay. So we'll go with those two. And we'll do quick flips on them. We'll do the... I don't bother with the um, the filler anymore. I don't think that really uh, does anything. Uh, tow to garage and then get taxi to garage. Like, I mean, it does do something, obviously. But um, I, I don't feel like it's worth it, is what I'm saying. I don't think it really matters that much. So what I will do is wash the car... It's a, th a three-stage, um, no, four-stage actually, isn't it? Four-stage process. Wash the car, hammer out any dents that it will allow me to, de-rust and respray. Uh, and then once we've done that, we sell. Um, that's that's the uh, the process. And so far, it has not let us down. We've made probably a thousand bucks on every car we've sold I want to say uh, so this one was 1500 right it's probably for some reason it always loses a bit of value when I bring it back I don't know if that's general depreciation or if it's um, damage caused when the uh, the game spawns the car in this spot and it drops onto the floor um, I, I suspect that may be the case. I think it may be damaged for that. This roof is not going to be saveable. I can tell you that much now. Um, I don't know whether it's worth cutting it off. I don't know what that'll do to the value, actually. Maybe we could use this one as a learning process. Uh, I think no matter what, we'll make our money back. Uh, 
Though I don't, at this point, I don't want to be making my money back. I want to be making profit. Money back is, is a loss, ultimately. There we go. Did I do under there? I think I did do under there. Sweet. Okay, we are washed. Uh, hammer time. Uh, I, should, I didn't say stop, did I? Should have done. Stop. Hammer time. Okay. There we go. Oh, yes. She's coming back into line. Very nice. That's the inner fender panel. There we go. What a beauty. Okay, that all looks good. No panels around here that it wants. Sorted, nothing inside, no. Nope. We are good to go on the hammering. Right, let's, uh, yeah, like I thought, that is a goner, that one. Oh, there we go, it's all up in that corner. That door as well. It's got quite a lot of movement in it. Anything up front? Doesn't appear to be. I was clicking my mouse randomly, I realised I don't actually need to. Because the uh, uh, thing, hammer icon, pops up, doesn't it? Uh, okay, so that seems to be that card done. That's stage two complete. Let us commence. Oh, stage three. I didn't mean to knock that over. There it is. That's what I was looking for. Right. There is a lot of, of rust on this car. So there's a lot to, to do. Let's get this sorted. Uh, I'm going to open that boot so that I can see inside. There doesn't seem to be any to do. Uh, but that will help me when painting it anyway. Man, this, this back panel is absolutely dreadful. It is completely shot with uh, with rust. Tell you what, I will finish doing this stage on these cars uh, and then I will come back to you guys because you've all seen me do this hundreds of times. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you when it's done. Okay, admit it, which one of you guys has hidden my cutoff wheel? Honestly, this is a juvenile trick to play on someone. Whilst I was away doing that, one of you came and moved it, didn't you? Honestly. Can't trust anyone these days. Uh, no, seriously, where where is it? It's got to be around here somewhere. Uh, I need to take off that rocker panel because you can't do them without removing them, not properly anyway. There's also uh, at least one of the doors, oh, not my mouse there, sorry. At least one of the doors is not um, not doing, it's, it's got a little bit of rust on it that you can't get to, it's that bit where the game doesn't let you uh, finish. What's that box doing there and why can't I pick it up? Oh well, never mind. Uh, am I going to have to buy another flipping wheel. I am, aren't I? That's typical. Oh well, at least I'll have an extra one around if I, if I ever find the other one. Oh, you can't buy them here. Where's my... Hmm. It seems to despawn these things if you leave them in here. That's not good. That's not good at all. Either that or... Has it got like a zone where it drops things? that have been despawned? I don't know. Seriously, where is that thing? Alright, for, for now I'm just gonna take the disc and swap it with the other one because I don't want the hassle of uh, of going and getting another one right at this minute. Uh, so we'll do that. But yeah, I, I like having two of them around. It uh, definitely helps out. That should be it, right? Why are you not popping out? Is there an, another one? 
Ah, there. Lovely. Right. Uh, oof. Take you over there. And take you off. Get you. Oh, my word. We're nearly there with this one, guys. Don't worry. All we got to do is paint it, and then it'll be good to go. Uh, I'll let you know when we get to that point. Right, I have got the appropriate colour and we will start with spraying this which looks like it's got a bit of dirt on it to be honest uh, which is a shame, don't know how that happened uh, Right, it's probably just sitting out here in the rain um, you should always do your um, high quality uh, paint jobs it, in the pouring rain by the way just so you know you get an excellent finish uh, from a rattle can when when you're spraying in the rain um, just a pro tip there for you that's that's a lie by the way I'm joking you you really don't you really don't get what you want um all right am I unable to no I'm able to do that I need to get that headliner out don't I Am I going to have to take off the mirror? Yes, I am. Oh, so many stages to these. That's not that's not a screwdriver. Uh, so many stages to these jobs. Like you want a quick flip, and it just won't let you do it. Now, for some reason, the last one let me take out the headliner. Um, oh, <laughs> it literally fell out. That's brilliant. Yeah, the last one let me take out the headliner with the. Uh, sun visor is still attached and it does seem that this one is no different uh, so can we can we do anything about that we can do a little bit what is up with that okay apparently we can't do that I think that's um, that's not rust I think that is Ooh, that is rust however I think a lot of that is uh, lines from not being straight uh, there we go that looked like it popped then although there is still some bits and pieces here and there oh dear this job is is gonna go on and on isn't it uh, come on let's get you covered up Sounds like I'm talking to a a woman I found in the street falling over or something. Come on, let's let's get you covered up, dear. Get you nice and safe and warm inside. Uh, blimey. Right. Okay, I think that's all I can do there. What can I do here? I think that might be dirt on there. I wish the rain would clean the dirt. Uh, it would be really helpful if it did. Uh, okay. And then this... Oh, we can paint this one. Okay. I don't think it's really going to... I mean, it's not going to fix the part, but it will give us um, probably star on paint work. Or at least, you know, the value will be there. Let's put it that way. It will improve the value. Really, the middle of the night is the wrong time for me to be doing this, isn't it? Am I out of paint now? I am out of paint. Right. Let's go make it daytime again. Uh, get another tin of paint. And uh, there we go. And see what we can do with this thing. Is Can we actually do any more than we've done I don't know oh there we go there that panel is not painted there we go it is now lovely we've got a bit on this door quite a bit on this door and on that sill bits on the inside of the door as well I'm glad I took off uh, those internal door cards there we go, bit on the 
roof of the boot. Boot lid, should I say? The roof of the boot. What is going on with my my naming abilities? They're all gone. They're all gone. The roof of the boot. I ask you. Uh, there we are. Uh, this door needs painting, even though it's not fully uh, fully restored. It's as good as the game would let us get, so that is going to have to be what we'll do. Come on. I want to do that bit. Come on. Oh, blimey. Alright, let's do it when it's on the car then. Uh, oh, where did the painting go? There it is. I've, I've lost which bit it was I was even painting. But, oh, my word. It's, this is not going well, guys. <laughs> it's one of those jobs that's really uh, causing me issues. Uh, right, well, that's do you back up you're as good as you're gonna get uh, and then let's pop you on and uh, weld you up eesh I was not planning on this taking this long but it, it is what it is isn't it it is what it is I wanted to get our chroming well underway uh, today maybe we still will uh, I don't know right um, I did take a door card out of there as well let's put that back just just for an extra dollar or two how are we now okay all right we didn't make a grand but we made a lot oh there was still bits missing as well that probably didn't help okay uh, Flipping egg. On to the next one. Okay, we are on to the paint job, which uh, <laughs> is going to be pretty lacking in quality by the looks of it. Blimey. Right. Does that all look done behind there? It does. It looks good. Cool. Okay. Again, quite a lot of parts on this car that are the wrong colour. Uh, it's interesting. It's very interesting. Uh, get these bits all put back if we can. The the door this time um, we got a little pop when I'd done it all, so that was that was a nice little uh, encouragement. Um, yeah, it actually showed me that uh, that it was done. And all of the bits of rust on the little bottom bit vanished. So yes, very, very grateful for that little uh, mercy. There we go. Right, get the, uh, the roof done. Okay, that one's out. We need a new pot of paint. We are so nearly there, guys. So nearly there. I'll get this one done and then be back with you when we sell it. Okay, there we go. I've done the best I can do with that roof. I've tried and I can't get that little bit of green, no matter what I do. So, I don't know, hopefully that's done enough. Let's have a look. Whoa, okay, yeah, that's done enough. 4320 for a car we paid $588 for. We've got 4320 back. I will take that. Yes. Thank you. Right, let's go uh, get these parts chromed because that's more than paid for it um, now. So we will head over there if I can remember how to even start the car. There we go, right. Into first, take the handbrake off. Let's go in second. Right, hopefully all these parts stay with us. It's looking a bit precarious, but never mind. Oh, have we lost anything? I don't know. I can't tell if we've lost anything. 
we've probably lost some bits um, but we will stop here I love that turbo noise it's so funky uh, right let's get out uh, open these doors and get ourselves some chrome beautiful we love it we love it okay and this bit I didn't paint that I should have painted that uh, well I guess we'll see what it says in terms of color condition anyway um, we did paint this I can't believe I didn't paint that bit was that all I brought just those three bits it was okay so that's been 900 bucks um, so far uh, we'll go and get those done uh, put back on the car rather they already are done nice hopefully they're staying with us ah there was an extra bit typical typical right well let's stop here handbrake on properly on and get out and we can go and reattach the roof how about that uh, let's grab the welding kit uh, and yeah oh actually we don't want to put this back on yet because we want to do the other parts don't we um, yeah so we would we would have to take it off again anyway even if we did that uh, which is a shame but another couple of bits one two oh blimey I did do three parts just then didn't I I'm losing bits all over the place. Let's take this one over. I'll go get this one chromed. Um, yeah, we must have dropped something else as well. Did I not pick something up? I don't. Maybe I left it right over there. Or maybe it flew out the second I. Uh, yeah, there you go. Look, over there. There's the grill piece. Flew out of the car. Right. Man. Okay, so that's $1,200 worth of chroming already. And we've barely begun, and I I can't pick that up, can I? Ah, oh, this is why I used the car in the first place. What I need to do, I think, is get one of those trailers that's got the uh, the roof on. I might be able to afford it actually, just the roof for my trailer, so that I can move these bits back and forwards uh, without without too much hassle. Uh, I was going to put it over near the bin then. And I thought that's I thought better of it. That was a bit risky. What are you? You're an in interior door panel for a lad okay well clearly we don't need you anymore I'll go get that other bit anyway here we go this is one bit that actually can go right back on uh, except that I've left all my tools outside from where I was uh, stripping cars beautiful so you can go back on and then the grill piece can go back in and we start to see uh the beauty that el cromino could be <laughs> it's going to be a weird looking car isn't it but that's the point it's supposed to be a weird looking car it is a weird looking car um i like it i like it right well i've not got as far as i'd really have liked to in this episode i was hoping to get quite a lot of these body panels done um but we will leave it there um we will pick up again next time where we get a bit more uh, a bit more done on the El Cromino. Uh, thank you very much for watching, I really do appreciate it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!